Time for some fantasy bits. I'm going to hit you with a player at camp who I think has a chance to go off. You know, this is just a superstar. This is not some low, low-hanging sleeper that I'm, you know, shooting to the sky with. It's Garrett Wilson, who's not out here because he's so damn focused on getting back out here. He's going through conditioning. He had a, a little tweak, lower sprain. Everybody's saying it's going to be fine. People aren't worried about the chemistry, not the reporters, not Salah, not anybody, and probably not Garrett Wilson, guys. Uh, let's dig into it, shall we? Let's do it. He's currently 10th on Fantasy Pros, if you look at the rankings, uh, projected as a late second round pick, finishing 21st at receiver last year. He put up over 11 1,100 yards, and that quarterback situation was an absolute mess. So I think it's really okay, valid, to think Aaron Rodgers is going to vault him into the top 10. Now, we've seen chemistry, guys, between these two at camp already, even early before the little minor tweak that happened. 1,300 yards. Can you tell me that's crazy to think that he'll have 1,300 double-digit touchdowns? Come on. I think he'll totally reach that this year. We've got these grabs. They're electric. Uh, Garrett Wilson's going to be okay. He's a, a, a guy who's elevated also by playing against Sauce Gardner, one of the best. They came in together. There's a lot of competition in that, and iron sharpens iron, as LeBron's tweeted to those two, uh, and their hard knocks leaked footage that was teased earlier this week. If you get him 10th at receiver off the board, if you get him in those first couple of rounds, second, third, fourth, like that is brilliant. That is your wide receiver one in an offense that should bring a lot of value where he's being taken and it's almost a good thing for fantasy value that he is missing some time that these highlight reels and the hard knocks of it all and all of the hype isn't out there because I could see him going inside the top seven at wide receiver inside the top six and then you're spending a lot for him so I wouldn't uh, go that route I'd take him now and hopefully he stays off the field